Uh, today let us see the data validation using custom option. Let us see how to make use of this uh, option called custom in data validation. So for example now we are going to take, take a situation. Uh, say for, uh, shall, what shall we do now? Uh, take some, uh, some number here. So what I am going to do is I am putting here uh, 20 and uh, this is the uh, cell that we are going to use for this data validation go so select data click data validation under uh, settings here allow below you have an option for custom custom and what I am going to do is um, uh, we can apply a formula here so this is the cell if this cell, what is the formula that we are going to apply is if this cell is less than of uh, this uh, if this cell is equal to into into two it is the condition that is this cell needs to be this value into 2 it means 40 if uh, it's equal to 40 the, this cell is a valid cell then we can use this input message and alert in alert we are going to say we have to tag the error message into the one you okay so if i enter value 40 nothing will happen if i enter value 41 we will get an error message. This is how you need to make use of this uh, data validation custom. You can apply any formula and this is the condition that has to be met. Instead of uh, giving equal to, if you say if it is uh, something greater than symbol, it means any value greater than this value here, this cell into 2. Let us see how this works. Now it uh, so if I apply 40, you will get an error message because the value should be greater than this value into 2, that is 40. So if I enter uh, 41, you will not get error message. If I enter 42, you will not uh, get error message. So the another way of applying this same condition is you can directly directly put a formula in, in your data validation, like instead of going to this uh, this thing. We can select this cell is equal to or uh, you can directly assign a value greater than 40. So that is the condition. It has to be greater than the numbers that what we enter need to be greater than 40. So if it is 41, it will not provide error. 42, 50 will not get. If you go for uh, some 40, you will start getting error message. This is how uh, you can uh, put a custom formula into the data validation.